So centralized unit is catering to the top two protocol of layer two, which is PDCP and SGAP. But for better clarity, I'm showing here all the four protocols of layer two, and we'll see how the data is flowing from the upper layer to the lower layer uh, in layer two. So layer two, the data flows from all the four layers, which we just talked about. IP packets, which is coming from the upper layer, in this case, layer three, which is traveling as a service data unit to the layer two, and are encapsulated in a radio period. So whatever the data which is coming in a IP packets from the layer three is being then encapsulated in the radio bearers, which we can see here as an example of radio bearer X and radio bearer Y. So in, in the layer two, we'll see that how the packets are being encapsulated inside these radio bearers as a SGU, which is a service data units. There could be a multiple different packets which will combine together and makes one RB or resource uh, or radio bearer. And then we'll see how it is passing on further to the MAC layer and converting it into a transport block at a MAC layer. Uh, these two RLC PDU from RPX radio bearer X correspond to one IP packet, which is N and N plus one. Whereas uh, the radio bearer Y, which is corresponding to one IP packet, which is M. So this gives an overall uh, idea about how the packets are flowing from the upper layer, which is layer three, to the lower layers, which is MAC here, and converting that IP packets into the transport blocks.